How's it going, fellow Hearthstoners? My name is Christophe Source, and today we're going to be checking out Raynad's TGT Dragon Priest deck. So, I don't think we're really going to need Holy Nova, um, but having the tech and Twilight is pretty good, and even having the Corruptor. So, we got a nice, like, 3, 4, 5 curve, and we even have the option to drop the uh, Corruptor because the Azure Drake is in our hand already, so. It's like pretty dang good. Let's go ahead and heal him so we can end up winning the game. Because if you don't heal your opponent turn two when you have no other plays, then it's just bad karma. See, he healed himself, so now he's going to lose. Alright. Nice. Cool. And I just crafted Chill Ma for this um, deck too, so should be pretty cool. Sweet. So this is really good for us that he has nothing to play. Unless if he is just like a giant AoE board control. So like even here, even if he um, plays Shadow Madness, it's not really going to do anything. So <laughs> should be okay. Um, he's dropping a 5 drop, so okay. I had a feeling it might be Corruptor. And that makes it a little awkward for us. Um, hmm. So I know this looks a little bit weird, but I think I'm just going to buff this. And heal. And now we have a Twilight Whelp, and we're just going to go face again. Because we don't really have a turn 6 anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Because if I were to kill this, I would have to trade and then um, Corruptor. I don't really want to do that. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so it looks like this guy might be playing the same deck as us. <laughs> Not sure if we should drop Chill Ma though, because he doesn't really have anything, and if he ends up killing it, then... I don't know. Like, we take all the damage and everything. Hmm. Oh, is he going to buff it? Okay. Dang, that kind of sucks. Hmm. I know this looks really weird. But I'm just gonna do it. Just roll with it, guys. We just gotta make sure that we maintain board control. So I don't think we're really gonna use Holy Nova like any other time. Plus, we have another one in our hand, so it's whatever. Yeah, this guy's definitely running the same deck. No. A 610, wow. That's pretty crazy, yo. I think we'll just fill up the board with minions. We'll just go face. So if he is running the same deck, then we don't have to worry about um, light bombs. I don't know if he would be running the exact same deck, maybe? But either way, we're going to have 3 damage from this, because I highly doubt he's going to trade into the Azure Drake. Um, yeah, so I don't know, unless if he has a pretty nice clear here, I don't think he's going to be able to win. Nice. <laughs> So now he can't even Shadow Madness to make it die, but I don't think he has Shadow Madness either way. He could have Chill Maw though, I guess. 
Okay. So now he can heal himself, so then he would still live? Okay. Yeah, and he has a taunt. Okay, I don't know why that took him so long to figure out, but that's okay. I think we should probably kill it. Yeah, we'll just play another technician. Alright, cool. Yes! Alright, so up against a warrior, um, hmm. I feel like it might be acceptable to keep all these cards, but. Maybe we should throw back the Corruptor, because it isn't a dragon, so it won't trigger this. Yeah, I think we'll just throw it back. Okay, Shadow of Death, I guess that kind of works too. <laughs> Even though we kind of want this later, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. We'll see. Okay, there's another dragon. Mm. I think we'll just save it. Because next turn we can play this guy, and then the turn after we can play this, and then the turn after we can play um, another one of these dudes, and then um, heal also, so. Yeah. Or we can just save coin, I guess. That 2 4 taunt for 2, though. This is like an insane card, dude. <laughs> so much value. And you can't death spider right now either, which is nice. He's got a beast in his sights. Hmm. Could just buff it. Hmm. Yeah, actually, I think I'm going to do that. Just so this is a pain for him to kill. If he has to use Execute on it, then that's, like, pretty good. And it's annoying enough to where he can't just ignore it, so... Is he just gonna wait? <laughs> just gonna wait. Nice. It's actually a really good draw. Now I can even... coin this out. Yeah, <laughs> dude. So good. He's still at 26 health, but he's or beating down his armor though, so wonder if he top deck execute. Oh, he did. Round of applause, boys. Kappa shift shift or slash slash kappa shaft slash slash. Um yeah, we can go ahead and play this. Just get that card draw going. Another Twilight will, will help. Yeah. You're holding a dragon. Pog Champ. That's actually kind of annoying. So hopefully he doesn't have a brawl. It's a really good hero power, dude. I know when I saw the Justicar True Heart, I was like, oh my god, control warriors so insane. And then even the priest though, that heal. It's pretty insane too. That's what I kind of want to do is play like a super control priest, 
because there's a lot of like control warriors on ladder and i know before control priest would be um control warrior like and then in the deck that i would want to make you would put at least one mind control maybe two but the thing is, is you have to be able to deal with all the aggro too because like paladin can get pretty crazy sometimes so so hopefully he doesn't have a brawl he doesn't have a brawl we're looking pretty good but if he does then we're not looking so good so wonder if he disconnected oh maybe he was just away okay oh, okay so he just really didn't have a good play at all um i think we could just kill that and then Go ahead and heal this. Just so he has to have Death's Bite to get through, which I don't even really know if it matters if he gets through anyways. I will drop this too to make sure that... Um, well, to hopefully make sure that he dies next turn. Ah, he does have Brawl. <laughs> he was just wanting to push the limits, man. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that four armor though. Shield slam? Oh my god. Alright, um. Actually, I think I'm gonna drop both of these instead. Dude, that armor though. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so crazy. Oh, he's already at 16 life. It's insane. What you gonna do with that weapon, boy? Got another shield slam? Tank up. Two OP. <laughs> if we get a Valen's Chosen, that'd be kind of cool. We actually might be able to draw into one. We got two draws. Sweet. Friend. Vulgin. Just keep his armor down, I think. I think that's a good play. Or the best play. What's nice is he can't even kill that dragon yet either. The Twilight Guardian. He's like super big I like the dragons I really love like chill Ma looks like pretty insane if you were to like see it in like a CGI film or something that'd be like that'd be pretty tight actually hoping he drops Yasera something even though he can't if you think about it I think he pretty much has to like armor up each turn he could have like a shield block maybe too yeah so but this is really helping him live though Okay, so that's not bad either, because he's going to get more armor doing this. Ah, oh, shield slam. No. That's by okay. That makes sense. Dang. We're so close to killing him, boys. Holy Nova. Hmm. We actually aren't holding a dragon either. <laughs> this is pretty bad. Mm, this is kind of useless for us. Yeah, so now we had to drop our dragon because 
It's actually good because then he won't kill this. <laughs> he knows we don't have a dragon. Oh god. Okay, well at least we can take it. That's pretty good for us. Actually, wait a second. Look at Holly Noah. Yeah. Now we might win. Oh wait, he still has the armor up, never mind. Oh no, we need a dragon. Need a dragon. Come on, you Sarah. For me, not for you though. <laughs> if he plays if he drops you Sarah, we'll be sad, boys. He actually might be able to get away with it, because we only have nine damage right now. He'd live with one HP. I wonder if he's worried about that. I think he's thinking about it. Like a nine drop, like Nefarian or something. Ah, okay, the shield made it. Dude, that armor though. Lasting for days. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I feel like he might have another brawl, so I'm just going to keep doing my thing. I guess we could have risked the 1 and 3 with Ysera. But then we don't have something for Ren Blackhand, so... He could feel safe here, though, and drop, like, a Ysera. And then we'll just rend. Oh my god, dude. He's so good. If... if if it is a code, it's not good. Roland? Cool, that's master, okay. Oh, man. I feel like I should do it. Maybe. What if he gets a chill mod, though? Mm, okay. Executed. Oh no. Please no brawl. I wouldn't be surprised if he had another brawl though. That card though. Okay, it was some bonus. Sweet. Wait, do we not win? Yeah, we win. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, so here is the deck. We got some Holy Smites and Shield, Power Word Shields and Clerics to deal with the early game and Twilight Well, There's like a lot of early game. Um, the Wormrest Agent, pretty insane. Shadow Word Death, always good, especially with the more control meta. Pretty nice. Uh, Villain's Chosen, good buff. Blackwing Technician, value, value for Black Cultists. Can be value for Dragon Skin, especially with um, Villain's Chosen, pretty insane. Uh, Twilight Guardian, value card. Holy Nova, good for taking care of those um, token paladins and uh, shamans and such. Uh, Azure Drake, card draw, spell power, pretty standard. Uh, Blackwing Corruptor, pretty good. You get that 3 damage on a minion, and it's still a 5 4 for 5, which, yeah, it's pretty insane. Vulgin, it's, I mean, you could steal some, like, health from a Yasser or something, and then it's a 6 12 for 5, so insane value. Um, Chill Maw, the one of the newer cards, I think the art looks pretty insane, and it's pretty good too, especially if you have a dragon in hand, because then they have a huge board, like, there's no way, like, you're just going to destroy them. And Red and Black Hand for all the uh, control matchups, really good against Ysera, and then, of course, we have Ysera, so, <laughs> and which is good for control matchups and helps you uh, close out the gap um, and catch up, so, yeah, it's pretty good. All around, I really like this deck, and it got me a winning streak, so sweet. Um, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And uh, for those of you watching, I'm going to put the deck in the description below, so you guys can check it out on Earthbone and all that if you're watching through YouTube. And like always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in another one of my videos. Peace out.